All your sessions on Bramble are recorded and transcribed. Over time, these recordings become an incredibly valuable resource for both tutors and students alike. Recording brings two primary benefits. It provides students with access to a great personalized revision library, but it also helps to keep students and tutors safe online by providing a record of every session. All lesson recordings are saved immediately on your sessions page. Each card here represents a single session and displays the lesson information, including the date, time, session number, and email address of each participant. The synopsis you see here is generated according to the most discussed term in the session. It means at a glance, both tutor and student get a good sense of what is covered in any tutorial, and it also reminds the student of the extensive content they've learnt. You can label each card with the subject too, helping you organise and colour code your session's library. A really useful and often overlooked piece of information is the workout here next to your name. This can be especially helpful for tutors to derive how active the student has been in the session. Some tutors actually use this to reflect on their teaching style and whether they want their students to speak and engage more in their lessons. If you wanted to access the visual material of a previous lesson, say for example this English literature session down here, you can view and download a PDF copy of the work covered by clicking on this icon. A copy of this will also be sent to you in an email after exporting the notebook. If you want to watch the full session, you can play it back by clicking on the play button here. Postmodernist literature contains a broad range of concepts and ideas that include responses to modernism, so what we saw in the last slide, responses to technological advances, obviously this was starting to happen around the 60s, which is when We've introduced literature. smart playback, which is symbolised by this brain icon. When enabled, it automatically detects silences and pauses in recordings and skips through them without missing any content on screen. You can click on the brain again to disable it. You can also speed up and slow down the recorded voice when needed. However, what really reaps the benefits out of your session recordings is the ability to smart search within your library. You can find out more about this by checking out our smart search video.